Assalamu alaikum hello friends how are you today i'm going to show you how you can start your own local server uh, i'll provide you a free database that uh, we create me and my team and uh, it's uh, fully optimized and uh, it has every script that you need for your base server so the link is in description you can download it from there it's only 230 mb i add everything is in it and you just have to right click on it and extract it okay it's gonna take some time not too much a little while it's uh, extracting um uh, you have to download the xamp and the hide sql okay the hide sql and the xamp you need only these two softwares to download links are in description you can download it from there and install them the hide sql and the xamp just install both okay and uh, after installation and extract the server you just have to start the xam right click run as administrator it's look like this and now uh, start the apache oh, sorry click on it and click yes to install the apache services yes also mysql we need only these two now start the apache uh, there's lots of people who always ask uh, our server isn't start because they didn't start the apache sometimes this is uh, the reason the server didn't start sometimes and start the mysql it started and working perfect now you have to start the hide sql but uh, you don't you have to install the hide sql but you no, don't need to open it now click on the admin when you click on the admin the php admin appears okay go to the test server in the test server you can see the tx data uh, the zap hosting and uh, here you can find the resource folder and here is the sql script sorry the sql uh, file that we add into the php admin okay now we have to i add it already but uh, when you have to add it you have to click on new right here premium because uh, the sql name is premium and click on create okay it's just for uh, to show you how it is work premium create and now uh, when you create the premium just click on it uh, first time there is nothing but when you click on the premium there is nothing and then you have to click on import click on import choose the file go to the path where your server my server is here uh, the test server too go into it tx data zap post here is the premium click on it and open it here is the premium sql just click on go it's uh, getting some time and uploaded um, no problem with it and after uploading it's look like this everything is in it and um, now the server is ready to go minimize it also minimize this you have to go to the the lic you have to open it up and change the sv license key 
this license key you have to change it where you get it i'm going to show you open up the browser and right here this one this link copied and uh, you have to paste it here and enter sign in i already sign in so it's gonna show me this register now you have to name it um i already name it okay the test server too because we add it there now and uh, in uh, initial server ip address it's your ip address so you're gonna add here okay and after that pick a type home hosted because we are going to local server and here you have to write the home hosted and then i'm not a robot generate select your ip when you generate it it's going to show you the key here this is your key copy it and paste it here the license key and now we have to start the local host now we have to go a little back go to fx server go down here is fx server now double click on it allow when you done that now it's stop here okay when you first time start it now we have to go to the browser open a new tab right here l o c a l h o s t localhost colon four zero one two sorry one two zero slash a u t h auth enter uh, i already uh, done that but you have to click on cfx re okay um, i already done it so i'm gonna log in it there's nothing just uh, go with the cfx dot re okay and it's here now go to the master actions reset fx server confirm now here you have to select the local server data because we already add the data click on it we have to add the path path for the uh, resource and the cache where the resource and cache and server.cfg uh, we we add it uh, now so there's no cache but there is server.cfg and uh, resources this is the folder you have to click here here okay and copy all these tags control c go here control v okay next config file detected we already uh, detect the server.cfg now save it save and start it's gonna starting it's automatically go to the live console and show you everything now the server is running and now we have to start the server and check it's working and it's absolutely working
desktop okay so the server is starting and uh, i skip the uh, loading screen you can also change the loading screen from the loading screen section now you have to write here t slash h u d hood sure uh, show balance and jobs it's uh, a complete uh, database let me show you there's uh, everything in it uh, the properties uh, um, garages lspd every job is working and uh, there's also robberies hunting job uh, lester each and everything will be work and uh, all the scripts are um, up to date and uh, uh, optimized and uh, if you need uh, any script or um, any mlo um, join my discord server there's uh, lots of scripts and mlos you can download them from uh, uh, from my discord server also in tomorrow's video i'll tell you how you can give yourself a v menu and uh, how you can set your uh, group as an admin so it's uh, in tomorrow's video like the video subscribe my channel and share it thanks for watching allah peace